Hello boys and girls, in this video I wanted to talk a little bit about kinetic sculptures. In case you don't know what kinetic sculpture means, it basically means making art using engineering. Alright, basically art with moving parts. So it was just a basic attempt, I was just uh, the following which you see. I was just trying to make a robotic kinetic sculpture using Arduino. So uh, let me talk a little bit about this. So it's it's like a face of a dragon or a wolf, something like that. So the eyes have LED which is blinking as you can see, which is connected to pin 5. And at the back we have a servo motor. So again which is connected to Arduino, pin number 8. And uh, the, the interesting thing which I did here uh, was using ChatGBT for creating the course. The code for the Arduino, uh, I, I just, as you can see, uh, the following uh, I, I just uh, told the chat GPT about the pin numbers and what kind of motion I want so it just created the entire code which I then copy pasted to Arduino IDE and uh, so yeah that, I think it's pretty cool that uh, chat GPT is able to do, do all these kind of codings and the body in this kinetic sculpture is 3d printed so I designed this th entire thing including the the face of this wolf and the stand for the servo motor on uh, Fusion 360 then I 3D printed it using Creality Ender version 2 so that's how I did it so that's kind of uh, I'm just trying to practice making a few of these kinetic, kinetic sculptures another thing which I would like to talk about in this is uh, using this Autodesk recap software which allows you to 3D scan without using a 3D scanner so that is a very interesting software. So I'm, I'm, I look forward to using that uh, that feature to scan a face of my relative and make a statue or a moving sculpture out of it. So I'll try to make that and show it to you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.